everyone can learn to ride a bicycle. And I like the encouraging message, but are training wheels really the answer? A book review, this time on Bike Physics. Took a trip to the thrift store into Half Price Books. Picked up a book for you today. This one is, uh, Everyone Can Learn to Ride a Bicycle. It's pretty cool art. We've got some pretty cool art on the back and it says, Yes, yes you can, of course you can, yes, why couldn't you? Yes you can. It's, it's a very encouraging book all about learning to ride a bicycle. Want to learn to ride a bicycle? Let's take a look at some of the art, because it's actually pretty cool. I don't know what's up with this guy's head, but that girl really wants to learn how to ride a bike. And he is pretty encouraging. Got a properly helmeted head, got some really good crash sequences. And my favorite part, the variety. Look at the guy with a trailer? And a recumbent? Nobody shows recumbents. And a speed racer? A conservative Jew on a bicycle in Central Park? Another trailer? A wheelie? And my favorite, a cat lady on a bicycle. Now that's some variety. Want to learn to ride a bicycle? First you need to choose the perfect bike for you. Watch everyone ride. They all learned how. Come on, let's give it a try. Training wheels are helpful. Okay, okay, that's, that's, okay, we'll get back to that later, but training wheels have not been shown in my experience or my children's experience to be helpful. They keep you from tipping over. Yes, they do, but they also prevent you from actually learning to balance the bicycle, which is the most important part. Training wheels. Mm -hmm. If we raise them up a smidge, you'll begin to feel your balance. Actually, no. The kids just ride around like, like this, leaning on one wheel. And it's always one wheel, it's not the other one. They just depend more on that thing. Now we take them off. That's a bit scary, but try it. Just don't put them on in the first place. In the grass, hard to pedal. Maybe down a small hill? Oh dear. Oh, hold on. And hold on he does as they go back and forth and back and forth, running all bent over. And of course she crashes again. Pump your legs. Oops, you nearly had it. Now here's the encouraging part. Don't give up, you'll get it. Find the courage to try it again and again, again and again and again and again and again and again until by luck, grace, and determination, you're riding. A bicycle. And now, you'll never forget how. So this says uh, two-time Caldecott medal winner by Chris Rashka. I mean, the art is great. And the ideas are pretty common, but they're not super effective. I didn't learn to ride a bicycle with training wheels. I took a regular bicycle and I kicked it around in the backyard until I figured out how. Straight from tricycle to bicycle. I learned how in a couple of days by kicking the thing around. My kids learned, found a regular bicycle, took off the pedals, both sides, so there's nothing to interfere with them kicking along, and then they learn just how to balance, and then eventually they're like, hey dad, I want the pedals back on. Put the pedals on, and like 20 minutes later, they're riding along totally fine, having a great time pedaling away with those tiny little legs and those tiny little crank arms. Super cute. You could buy a little balance bike, you could. I got this one for $4 at a thrift store, but that's not necessary. Just buy a bike that the kid can sit on with flat feet, take the pedals off. Remember the left one is left hand threaded, so it's opposite thread and the right one is a normal thread. And then have the kid ride. You could buy a custom bicycle, super sweet, super fun to purchase the best bike for your kid, but it's a little kid's bike, whatever, not a big deal. Just buy the kid a bike, take the pedals off, have them kick it around, and my kids, they actually kicked it around for a couple of years before they felt like actually riding. They weren't that interested. Honestly, everyone can learn to ride a bicycle and should learn to ride a bicycle. And the encouraging part of this book was really, really cute and really good. Yes, you can, of course you can, why couldn't you? But training wheels, not the best. My first bicycle book review. Everyone can learn to ride a bicycle by Chris Roshka. Thanks for watching Bike Physics for all the bicycles and motorcycles and family adventures. And thanks for that thumbs up too. Really helps a lot.
New videos most Tuesdays. Subscribe for more. If you haven't figured it out yet, I got this other channel called Learn Physics. It's all about physics and education and that kind of thing. So check that out too.